Hi everyone, Brian Strausser, Principal and Chief Executive here at Bright Path. Today is Friday, May 10th, 2024, and this is a really special day for the team here at Bright Path and I because it is our 10th anniversary as a business. I started Bright Path on this day in 2014, uh, just a day after wrapping up a 21-year career at a Fortune 30 company. Uh, I was bored, I was looking to do something different, um, was just about to graduate from business school and was like, I should try to put all of this new education to work and start a business. Um, wasn't sure this is what I would be doing 10 years later, to be honest. I wasn't sure if it would be successful. I wasn't sure if we could grow. I wasn't sure if there was even a market for the things that we wanted to do. But over the past decade, we have built an amazing team of talent. Uh, absolute experts uh, here at Bright Path in what we do across the areas of resilience that we have chosen to focus on. Uh, and together, the team and I have built an amazing culture, uh, a fantastic place to work, uh, and a company that provides enormous value to our dozens of clients around the world. Um, so I want to say thank you to our team here at Bright Path who have helped build an amazing company. Uh, and thank you to our clients and our supporters, those of you that listen to the podcast, who watch our videos, who buy our products, who come and listen to us speak at conferences. All of you make this, have made this an amazing journey for all of us here at Bright Path. We're really looking forward to seeing what the next decade holds. Thank you for your support along the way. And we're looking forward to talking with you again in 2034 and celebrating our 20th anniversary. Thank you. Thanks for watching our video. To learn more about how to manage uncertainty and disruption in your organization, be sure to like, follow, and subscribe to our video channel. And here are a few more videos that we've selected that will help you learn more about business continuity, crisis management, and crisis communications.